Hello, and welcome to the JWST Exposure Time Calculator. In this video, we will show you how to upload and use your own spectra in the ETC. These user-supplied spectra primarily serve as a supplement to the template spectra provided by the ETC. It can also help you save time that might otherwise be spent adding emission lines one at a time to a template spectrum, for example. Prior to uploading a spectrum to the ETC, you must first put the spectrum into the proper format in one of these three accepted file extensions, .dat, .txt, or .fits. The first column of this file must be the wavelength in microns. The second column of this file must be the flux density in units of millijanskys. The ETC does not accept files with comment lines or column headers. Please be aware that the ETC will only check that the above formatting is satisfied. It will happily accept files with wavelength or flux density in other units, but will interpret them as microns and millijanskys, respectively. Files with the second column and surface brightness units require special handling in the ETC. This is described later in the video. After you've confirmed that your Spectrum file is properly formatted with the correct units, go to the Upload Spectra tab in your workbook. Click on the Choose File button in the Upload Spectra pane. Select the file from your machine and click the Upload button. The ETC will then present a dialog box confirming that the file was properly read. Click OK. Note that Spectra cannot be deleted from this list and you cannot download the files from a workbook. However, these files can be overwritten if you upload a file with the same name. Also, uploaded Spectra will be available to other users you share the workbook with. Now, click on the Scenes and Sources tab. Select the default source from the Select a Source pane and click on the Continuum tab in the Source Editor. Click the Uploaded File Radio button and select the file from the drop-down menu. Now move to the Renorm tab and click the Do Not Renormalize Radio button. Click Save. You can view the spectrum in the Source Spectrum Plots. If you would like to upload a spectrum in Surface Brightness Units, click on the Shape tab and make the source extended. Any flux distribution will allow you to select surface brightness for the spatial normalization. Units can be specified as flux density per square arc second or steradian from the drop-down menu. We will leave the selection at square arc second and click the Save button. Note that the y-axis of the plot is now in units of surface brightness. This concludes the video on uploading spectra in the ETC. If you would like additional information on how to use the JWST ETC, see the links in the description for this video. Thank you.